everyone, this is Vandal. Welcome back. Today we are playing American Arcadia. Let's check it out. Wow, what is this, Mr. Walton? This comet is our new project, Arcadia. It looks like a city from outer space. <laughs> Not quite. Arcadia is indeed a city, but it would be built right here in America. Golly. Picture a city of dreams and hopes for the young and old alike where technology and science go hand in hand with fun and entertainment. Gee, that sounds like a dream, Mr. Walton. <laughs> because it is a dream, Comet. And remember, to reach our dreams, we need to soar higher than ever before. Are you ready to proceed then? Uh, yes. Yes, I'm ready. Good. We're recording now. So, please, sir, state your name, age, and occupation. Trevor Hills, 28, senior account manager at INAC, although I'm not sure about that anymore. I'm also the most popular person in Arcadia, but you probably already know that, right? Subject 1392, you are entering a restricted area. Oh, they're shooting at us. Stop running and surrender now. Ah! Subject 10392, turn yourself in or be neutralized. Yeah. Oh my gosh! You'll have to catch me first, you jerk! Can I hide? <laughs> Keep going. Oh my goodness. Yes, we know that, Mr. Hills. <laughs> Please continue. Uh, I used to have a mundane life. Just my everyday routine, and I, I liked it that way. But I think it all probably began about two weeks before that dreadful day. Okay, two weeks before. Good morning, Arcadia. Today we're enjoying a splendid temperature of 77.1 degrees and a humidity of 53% on this beautiful sunny Friday morning. Ooh, look at those blinds. So far, this reminds me of the movie Free Guy with Ryan Reynolds where it's like everything's a controlled environment. Morning, Kovacs. Kovacs. What do you say? Up for another exquisite cabbage breakfast? That a boy. Our little turtle, Mr. Kovacs. Auto droid to full cleaning. Yep, everything's robotic, everything's controlled. I was pretty good at Spectrex when I was a kid. But I'm not into video games anymore. <laughs> Look at even outside, it's a robot watering the grass. Piano? Well, it's not a Steinway, but it fits in my comfy hobbit hole. There's a radio there. <laughs> okay. Look how pretty. I like the aesthetics on this game so far. Oh, delivering packages. Morning, Mr. Bernstein. Good morning, Trevor. A monorail. And uh, over here on your right, you can see the Walton Family Memorial. It's a massive sculpture carved in stone of Elijah Walton, uh, his brother Donald, and Vivian Walton, Elijah's granddaughter and the current Arcadia representative. Next stop, INAC Gemini Tower West. INAC, that's where I work. Okay, so I guess this is our job. Trevor Hill. Welcome to INAC's Gemini Fancy. Towers. You've been working with us for nine years, ten months, and fourteen Dang. days. Thank you for your dedication. Every day you're reminded of how long you've been there. Still trying to beat my Spectrex high score, Mitch? It's just a matter of time, Trevor. Just a matter of time. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, sure. Whatever. I love the way this looks. Like, very retro, yet modern. Ada, the automated data analyzer, is the most powerful computer ever built. INAC technology inside. 
Trevor, my man. Hi, Gus. You look good, buddy. Gusto, Been going just to the for gym? you, American nah. Cappuccino. Nah, I need a gym to keep this ripped body in shape. Hills jeans. By the way, you going to the Blitz party tonight? Nope, I still have some stuff to finish here. Trevor, man, would it kill you to have a little bit of fun once in a while? Tending to Ada. I do have fun, moderately. I enjoy doing my job. Validated. You won't be enjoying it so much now that Romano is our new supervisor. Sending to Ada. What? Will Romano? Seriously? But that guy is a moron. <laughs> um, uh, validated. You know, Gus, sometimes I get the feeling that only absolute jerks, egomaniacs, and obnoxious people thrive in this company. I didn't know you were interested in the supervisor's job. I'm sending it to Ada. Validated. And, I, and I'm not. But William Romano, man, you gotta be kidding me. Have you ever wanted to leave all your worries behind and have the time of your life while exploring the world and making unforgettable memories? Now, thanks to the Arcadia Edge Travel Grant, you can experience what you've only dared to dream of. Because not everyone who wanders is lost. The Edge Travel Grant, only in Arcadia. Travel Apply now through Ordinary Mail or Adenet. Um, uh, Mr. Hills, you haven't really told us anything out of the ordinary so far. Do you really need to go through... I, I know what I've told you might seem irrelevant now, but it'll help you understand later. Trust me. Okay, nine days before that dreadful day. Good morning, Arcadia. <sighs> it's another beautiful day in the city of tomorrow. We're expecting a high of 75 degrees and humidity of 66%. It is so much like Free Guy. It's like the same thing every day. You know? Good to see you, Mr. Bernstein. Good morning, Just Trevor. the routine of everything. Oh, I hope you are up for a pleasant stroll along memory Don't lane. Have a good so day. keep those have cameras ready, day. because you might get some really, really nice pics of the Arcadia Spire up there. Next stop, INAC Gemini Tower West. Hmm. I wonder where this guy went. My hey, friend Millie. Gus isn't there. Have you seen Gus today? Is he sick or...? I don't think so. He just left early today. Really? He didn't say anything to me. We're gonna fall behind schedule. Man, I'll be working overtime to send all these Ada memos by myself. <laughs> Thank you, Gus. I'm here late. Jesus, this is gonna take me forever to finish. I should have been home three hours ago, and I still have a ton of work to do. CCV area. Oh. Press Y to interact with a device. Hey, hey! I'm still working here. Can I mind to you? Whoa! What happened? Six days before that dreadful day. Here we go. Ba -ba -ba -ba. But the cameras. That seems weird, like we're being watched. Weird. My fellow citizens, we have a new Edge Travel Grant winner. His name is... Hey. Isn't that Gus? Hey. Augustus Rainey, a 31-year-old senior account manager at friend. INAC. Soon, Gus will be enjoying Fiji's pristine beaches and crystal clear waters. I hope he packed an Aloha shirt and a pair of sunglasses. Oh, wow. Hmm. That's weird. Gus was never interested in any of this. So, I barely got to meet him, you know. They promoted me to a supervisor uh, two days later. Gus the Globetrotter left us. <laughs> That's the moron Romano, I supervisor. I really doubt that <laughs> Gus ever applied for the travel grant. Ah, uh, you know, Gus, not much of a talker. What a lucky son of a gun, though, huh? Huh? <laughs> Fiji. Ooh, a kill for a beach trip right about now. Anyway, uh, make sure that report is ready for tomorrow, will you? 
It'll be ready, Romano. Yes, Don't worry sir. About it. See, here's just mundane life, living a mundane life. The same song. The heck? What on earth? Four days before that dreadful day now. Okay. Same thing, let's see. Trevor Hills, welcome to Inax Gemini Towers. Oh. Hey, hey, did anybody hear that? It's that song again. Nobody? Really? Weird. What are they lying about? Ooh. Company? This. Hey, what? Francis. Morning, Trevor. That's it. <laughs> Listen, Dave, have you noticed some weird things going on lately in the office? Weird? How? What do you mean? I don't know. Lights going off, music suddenly playing in the PA system? No, nothing. Okay, well, yeah, forget it. Hey, bye. There must be a rational explanation for all this. There must be. The day before that dreadful day now. Okay. God, this can't all be a product of my imagination, can it? Hey, Trevor, you up for a couple no, of years no, after... No, 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 I, sorry, I, I can't. <laughs> I can't. Didn't even let him finish. Him. Leave me alone, damn it. Somebody please look at these screens! I'm the only one who sees this Damn. happening. Where? Maybe it's only stress. I've been working too much lately. I need to go to the doctor. It's it's been ages since I had a checkup. I'm back home now. No, I'm not in the mood to play right now. I don't even want to get close to the TV. <laughs> Not after last time. No thank you. Who knows what might happen if I turn that droid on. Hey Kovacs, am I going crazy, buddy? My little turtle. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna sleep a wink tonight. That dreadful day now. Okay, what happened? <sighs> Those were probably the worst two weeks in my entire life. Or at least the weirdest. Although it was nothing compared to what I was going to experience later that day. Do you know they even had a name for it? You mean a name for your... Yes, that's it. The day the running started. The running? Okay. Okay. I, uh, I have to get a hold of myself. It's Friday. Just a few more hours of work, and the week will be over. I'll finish here, go back home, have a Remember glass of warm milk, and go to sleep. Travel grant too. The only requirements are that you must be of legal age and have an insatiable wanderlust. <laughs> Request the application form via ordinary mail or internet. No, thank you. <laughs> okay, today's tasks. Nothing like some routine stuff to keep your mind occupied. Okay. Oh, come on! I didn't even save. Hey guys, oh, did you lose your- glitching. Gus is dead. What? Look at the sign. Gus is dead. Trevor Hills, please. Your supervisor requires your presence in the meeting room on the 10th floor. Now what? What the heck? Uh, 
That's weird. Well, this took a turn, didn't it? What on earth? Don't be a fool. It's like these signs are just for me. What's happening? is going to congratulate you for winning the Edge Travel Grant. What, what, who, who is this? I Just didn't even apply listen. for it. Three travel agents will be there with you to arrange all the paperwork. If you leave with them, you won't ever be seen again. What? What? Wait a second. I, I didn't even apply for the travel grant. See? Neither did Gus. Follow my instructions when you exit the elevator. Look, it's that's them taking him on camera. What, what? Wait! Okay, we have instructions that? to follow when we get out. Oh my Here, gosh. On the intercom, look at them. Do those guys look like travel agents to you? Mm. Take the elevator at the end of the hallway and go straight to the 20th, 20th floor. 20th floor. Whatever happens, do not stop until you get there. Oh my goodness, can I run? Oh, hey, hey, Trevor, come here. Can I run? Going I have days? good news for oh, you. No, 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 they've seen me. <laughs> oh my goodness! What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Hey, you can't be here, Mister. This is a private meeting. Uh, sorry, I, I'm. I just. I have, I have to. I just. Don't mind me. Bye. Oh my gosh! Look, they're gaining on me. <gasps> here they come. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Can you go any slower? Sorry, couldn't hold it. Take the stairs. Goodness gracious. Okay, now what do I do? When you reach the 20th floor, cross the Ada room lobby and enter the supercomputer room. The supercomputer room? I don't have clearance to access the- Don't worry, I'll take care of that. What the heck? Oh my goodness. This is nerve wracking. <laughs> Damn it, there's no exit here. Hey, you, strange voice or whatever you are. Can you hear me? What do I do now? Open Wait in this there. Door. I have to do something really quick. What? Calm down. Don't, Don't panic. I'll be right back. Help me. Oh, I'm so sorry to leave you hanging there, Trevor. But admin permissions are updated daily, so I have to do this right here and right now. Okay. Great. All checked. Next phase of the plan. Okay. There she is. Kendra Tomlin, my inept boss. She's probably been logged into her computer all day, lurking through her assigned citizen grid, enjoying a quiet day with no incidents. Well, that's about to change as soon as I shut down her computer from my cell phone. Which, I don't remember where I put. Oh, where did I leave my cell phone? Oh, so look, I did that billboard thing. Okay, where's my phone? Oh, there. Here you are. Got it. Now I only have to access Kendra's computer and... Unleash hell. Enter the I wrote IP down her IP address. here. Oh, how stupid Great. can I be? Only I could think of writing something that important okay, on my hand. One nine zero. Clutziest activist one ever. One seven something. And the other one looks like eight two. What is the middle part? I don't know. Maybe this one. It ends in a two. And then two three. Sorry for interrupting another hard day of procrastination, Kendra. Just a couple seconds to begin the cursing and screaming <laughs> in three, two, one, one again. There. And no, here it is. No, 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 Total no, no. system shutdown. Now, Kendra, you better follow the protocol like a responsible supervisor and call Jean. Yeah, of course it's Kendra. Yelling? Oh, you better move your sorry ass and get up here, or you will find out what yelling is. And here it comes, directly from the server room. Jean Wynn, the admin guy. <laughs> hey, Jean. Poor Jean, I really owe you one, man. <laughs> okay, the server room will be empty as long as Jean is pulling all of Kendra's oh, aggro. Okay. What took you so long? And by the looks of it, you it's gonna be a while. So next phase, get inside the server room. Can't be caught on the surveillance cameras. 
Okay. Surveillance room. The hallway to the server room is tracked by three surveillance cameras. I need to get close to the cameras and upload the loop footage from my cell phone. But I have to be sure the right video is uploaded to the right camera. Okay. So it's this way. This is one of them. But wouldn't it be behind me? Here. Ah, here it is. Okay. We got that one. Next, we need to find a picture. Of that man. There's that guy. Okay, so that's exactly the second one. Okay, next, we need to find the poster of somebody shaking hands. If I could have lunch today with anyone dead or alive, it would definitely be Elijah Walton. Okay, do we see this poster? Somebody shaking hands. This is where we came from. There we go. Do you want to upload all cameras? Yes, we do. All the videos are uploaded and playing the loops. I can enter the server room now. Okay, here's the server room. Shit, I forgot that Gene still uses the old four digit security system and I don't know his passcode. What could his passcode be? Oh, look, 1208. Oh, <laughs> look at this. I can't believe it. That's You're funny. an absolute disaster when it comes to security measures, Jean. But thank God for that. One, two, zero. Ta-da! Door open. Okay. What do we need to do here? Good. Now I only have to access the servers and grant myself admin permissions. Okay. Got it. Now back to my office to keep helping Trevor. Let's get out of here. Here's my office. Shit, I almost forgot to restore the surveillance cameras before returning to Trevor. Restore yes, done. all cameras are back to- Hey! Oh! oh uh, Kendra. Huh? You think this is normal? Uh, uh, I, 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 I can explain. She catch me? Seriously, I have tons of work to worry about, and they expect me to meet my deadlines with constant screw-ups? <laughs> this is not normal. Oh. Oh, you mean that? Uh, no, no, of course not. That is totally <laughs> unacceptable. This is the second time I've had the same sudden crash. Remember it also happened a few days ago? Boom. And all my work goes down the drain in an instant. Yes. Yes, I remember. Yeah, sure. Uh, definitely Jean has something to do about that issue, of course. <laughs> anyway, looks like it's going to take a while. Fancy a latte macchiato with the cafeteria? Ew. Uh, sorry, Kendra. I still have some things to finish, and given what happened to you... I don't want to risk losing all my work, too, you know? <laughs> Goodbye! Hi. In a hurry, Hi, this guy's waiting. Caught me. Come on, guy. I'm back. Trevor, I'm here. Okay, Trevor, I'm back. Oh, thank God. But, wait, your voice is... Oh, God. <laughs> I forgot to turn the voice modulator on. Ah, damn it. Oh, it's fine. I'd rather listen to a human voice than whatever that was before. What do I do? Yeah, what difference does it make now? Anyway, let me open that big door. Cameras are ready. Okay. Great, I can switch between them. There we go. Open. Wow, that computer room is really dark. <laughs> That's not a computer room, Trevor. Go inside, please. Uh, okay. 
You'll find an earpiece on that table ahead of you. Put it on so we can speak directly. <gasps> okay. I have the earpiece. Can you hear me? Loud and clear. And you? I can hear you too. Yes. I feel like I should be running still. What is this place? Where am I? And why does it look like the backstage of a TV studio? Because it is, Trevor. <gasps> this is Arcadia's backstage. What? No, 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 no. This, this is this is the Ada room, the most powerful computer ever built. Look here. That means artifact disposal area. This is where the containers from all INAC employees are dumped to be processed and destroyed. Look, we but think that, we're sending it to somewhere. That doesn't make sense. INAC would lose millions if they just... INAC can't lose shit because INAC <gasps> is not a real company. It's just another one of Arcadia's intricate lies. Oh my but gosh. But you've had lies already, Trevor. Let me show you the truth for once. It's like a um, Truman Show kind of thing too, right? Weird. So we're just living in a set. It's just a whole setup. Please, Trevor, have a seat. Oh my gosh. Now in its 55th season, American Arcadia. A 43-square-mile metropolis where each and every citizen enjoys a life of luxury and comfort. Broadcast live 24 hours a day, 7 days a week on every digital platform. The most watched media phenomenon on the planet. Arcadia, See, it's a TV show. a complex system of thousands of cameras registers the everyday lives of their 23,414 oh Arcadia-born citizens. Experience love, drama, and scandal from all of your favorite Arcadia celebrities. Steve Just, DJ Zoom, Tiffany Amber Gaines, and many more. Vote, oh my gosh! and be a part of... American Arcadia. There's an app even. Live from the Arcadia Dome. The I'm heck? Your host, Vivian Walton. Oh my what? gosh. What is this? This, Trevor, is your life. A life that has been recorded and compiled right down to the last second. What? Why on earth would anybody be interested in my life? That's exactly the problem, Trevor. <gasps> Nobody is interested in your life. I'm pretty sure you know who Steve Just is. Well, yeah, everybody knows aerobic Steve. He's... The most popular person in Arcadia? Of course he is. Well, this is Steve Just's camera rating. review rate. That's the number of people outside Arcadia who watch his life 24-7. Oh my gosh. And this is your track camera view rate. Actually, you only have one person following your track camera, and that's me. Oh You're not an absolute my goodness. Jerk, an egomaniac or obnoxious. You're just an average Joe with an ordinary life. Too ordinary. <gasps> Too ordinary? Too ordinary for what? To be oh profitable, my gosh. Trevor. You're not good American Arcadia material. In here, a popular person means sponsorships, media coverage, wow. ads, merchandise. In short, money. And as the audience ratings of American Arcadia So are I'm boring, I bring growth, no money. The show can't afford to maintain people like you anymore. <gasps> Unprofitable citizens need to be... be retired from the show. R retired? Retired? You... you mean... Yes, I mean exactly what you're thinking. But... What? They can't do that, right? They can't like, kill me. Can they? Not legally. But again... Who's gonna miss you if you never ever show up oh again? Oh my Nobody's gosh. Nobody's interested in your life, remember? Oh my god. This... This is a nightmare. This can't be true. Trevor, I know this is tough to swallow, but we have to keep going, okay? Oh. Okay. Oh my goodness, okay. how crazy. Okay, okay, okay. okay. <laughs> That's crazy. Okay, where are we going? We can try to use your anonymity to our advantage to get you out of here. But first things first, you have to leave the INAC building and get to the closest monorail station. I can move this. Okay. That's cool. Okay, the CCTV camera again. Open the door. 
Oh, I can probably move this way. Hey, uh, hey, I, I can't see anything in here. Could you do something about that, please? How do I turn All on right. my lights? Let me find a light source. Uh, is that better? Now let's try to find a way out of here. Mm, that's not the right light. Where's that light at? <sighs> Trevor, are you wheezing? You're in terrible shape, man. Okay. Did you get any exercise at all? No, I turn not, on the light. not since PE in high school. Because of my metabolism, I don't easily gain weight, so I don't usually do any. <laughs> okay, okay. I'm not here to judge your lifestyle or your dietary habits. Just save your breath and keep Oh, going. there we go. We can move this. Okay, so... Now we can pull this over. Can we move this guy? There we go. We're gonna move this guy down. Okay, move it up. Okay, I made it. Now, let's switch the camera over. There I am. Okay. Go this way. There we go. Trevor, hide! Right <gasps> no, but he must be around that stage. Oh my god. god. What do I have to call him the gallery? I hope that will think we're a bunch of idiots. Oh my god. I do. There we go. That wasn't too loud. Oh, there's this box. We can move the box. Let's move this over. Perfect. There we go. Goodness gracious, I'm in the air vents now. <clears throat> this is crazy. I like it so far. My fellow citizens, we have a new Edge Travel Grant winner. His name is Trevor Hills. Oh my gosh. A 28-year-old account manager with no friends and a boring life that nobody gives two shits about. Wow, lady. God, you're so mean, Vivian. I'm sorry, I just can't help myself. Wow. I know the rules. All grant winners must be publicly announced, blah, blah, blah. But honestly, I don't see the point in it. Who cares about this guy? Wow. Anyway, let's take five and we'll record it in one go, okay? That's crazy. Vivian Walton is a horrible person. <laughs> yeah, apparently. I think evil bitch describes her better, but... It's that evil bitch who hosts American Arcadia Live feeds every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday at 8 p.m. Wow. Three hour specials where the Walton Empire's true heiress drags her family legacy through the mud. <sighs> and the audience loves her. So, yeah, she's a horrible person. Sorry, man. Dang. This is crazy. Have you seen a guy around here dressed in 70s clothing? Yes, about 20,000 every day. Oh I work in American Arcadia, man. Can't you be a little more specific? Yeah, Caucasian male, fair-haired. Switch oh, the spotlight on? That description... I hey, what happened? What do I know? Let me fix it. It's working again. Okay, so I need to do that again. Could you please give me a hand with this light? There, there, there. Not my job, thank you very much. It's back on. Woo, I made it. Okay, what do I do over here? Ooh, I think I'm supposed to pull something from this way. Shoot. Okay, we gotta do that again. Son of a... Fix 
fixed it. It's on again. Okay, what's over here? This. Yikes. Okay. Uh. There we go, it's on. Hey, I think I found your guy. <gasps> oh! They got me! Have you seen a guy around here dressed in 70s clothing? Okay. Yes, I need to turn that light off. What happened? What do I know? Let me fix it. And then? There we go, it's on. Do it again. Could you please give me a hand with this light? Not my job, thank you very much. Fix it. It's on again. Again? Damn it. There we go, it's on. Okay, just little by little. <sighs> it's working again. Goodness gracious, this makes me nervous. Those scared me. <laughs> Somebody's standing. Mannequins. They're all mannequins. They put mannequins in here too, just to fill up seats. Yep. Now you're getting it. Weird. Oh, damn it, Trevor, hide quick. Any news? Not yet, but we've got all the exits covered. Good. He's not gonna get out of this building unless he grows a pair of wings. What do I do? Gosh. I hope she can open doors for me. Shit. Plan B, Trevor. Forget about the elevator. You have to find another way out. Oh my me? gosh. I'm an account manager. The only things I can find are mistakes and balance sheets. <laughs> <sighs> Let me think. Um, there's a, uh, there's a window in front of you, right? You're not thinking of... We need to get you to the closest monorail station as soon as possible. Oh my gosh. There's no other option. There's another station literally in front of the Inoc building. Didn't you hear them, Trevor? What part of all exits are covered didn't you get? Oh, this is a seriously bad idea. Okay, so what am I gonna do? Climb out the window? <gasps> oh my gosh. Oh gosh, this is really high. Would you please calm down, Trevor? I shouldn't have gotten out of bed today. Okay, CCTV. Be dead by now. Just don't panic and let me think of something. What's this? We can move this up and down. Where am I? Where is that thing? Oh, there it is. <laughs> Trevor, Trevor, you're doing all right. Okay, just keep. Going. Okay, I'm gonna make it. That's it. See, it wasn't that bad. I just realized that I don't even know your name or why you're doing this. I'd rather not give you more details right now, for safety reasons. But you can call me Kovacs. 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 Like, like my turtle? <laughs> no, man. Kovacs, the Hungarian scientists and architects of tomorrow. Science always finds a way and all that, you know? Oh, yeah, yeah, our Pat Kovacs. I was a huge fan too. I named my turtle after him. Dude, why do you keep bringing your turtle into this conversation? <laughs> well, I just thought, yeah, forget it. It stopped. Oh. Trevor, watch out. Don't let the bargain basement Beastie Boys see you. The what? Uh, I forgot you don't know the Beastie Boys. The uh, uh, travel agents. Don't let the travel agents see you. Okay, we can close the window. Gemini A6 R3. Things revert state. Okay. Hexagon, please revert shutter at my location. Thank you. Oh, that was close. Okay, here's another thing. Let's move this up. 
Hey, Trevor, I must say, you are coping quite well with all this physical stress. Despite your age. <laughs> what do you mean my age? I'm 28. You're... Oh. oh. <laughs> Sorry about that, I... Uh, uh. <laughs> He's only 28. <laughs> Don't worry about it. It's the mustache. <gasps> oh my gosh, what do I do here, there, in every window? Holy crap, holy. You see the guy? Nah. <sighs> Okay, the other camera. The stapler guy from office space climbing out of a window? Come on. Shit. Gosh, that was hard. It made me nervous. Wait, it looks like I'm supposed to go that way on that thing. Okay, let's see. Jump this? <gasps> now what? N now what what? Just jump over the gap and move forward. Are, are you sure? If I miss, I die. Oh, come on, Trevor. Even my grandpa could jump that. Ah! There's Mr. Hills, right there. what are you doing? You're going to hurt yourself, Mr. Hills. I have to oh, jump. Shit. The travel agents are here. Uh, jump now. Uh. Oh my gosh, Please, they're after running. me. Hurry. Stop immediately. Hurry, 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 hurry. Run. Keep running for God's sake. Oh my gosh, they're gaining on me! <laughs> Whoa, I have to be really fast crane, here. Trevor, okay. With the crane! Yes, trust me! Uh, oh no, 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 no! Hurry! Go! No! You got a death wish or what? Kovacs, I'm running out of- Jump as far as you can! Ah! Oh my gosh! Wait, you jumped into a swimming pool from the 20th floor of a building? <sighs> yeah. Yes. And <laughs> while I think it's pretty obvious, I'm not exactly a daredevil. Although in hindsight, that jump was nothing compared to what I had to do afterwards. Better already? Dry enough? No, I'm still soaking wet. <laughs> Sorry about that, but we don't have much time. Get moving before the travel agents get down here. Oh my gosh, this is never ending. Soar higher than ever before. I am. Well, is that a helicopter after me? That's gonna be expensive. Hope those people don't see me. Oh my gosh. That was pretty intense for just some office guy, right? This is pretty cool. I really like this. Keep going, Trevor. You're doing great. Now listen. To get to the station, I need you to cross the monorail tracks, right? You were gonna say that. Didn't you? Oh. I'm afraid so. Oh, damn it. Okay. We made it out. Now what? Ah, oh, there's agents there. Char. Watch out. Damn it! What do I do? Okay, there's CCTV. I, signal, I want you to haul ass like there's no tomorrow. Okay, I'm gonna turn on the car switch. Hills What's going on? The Inac East Tower? How is that possible? Somebody stop that car alarm. He jumped to the pool, man. Now, Trevor, to the damn pool. Trevor Hills. Damn! You can expect that. Oh. Come here, you. Oh. Oh my god, look how close he is to me! Get to the last car of the monorail! <gasps> Hurry! 
hurry, hurry, hurry. I made it. Yeah, in your face. <laughs> what are you going to do now, huh? Yeah, look at the face of that bestie kid or whatever you bestie call Bestie kid. <laughs> no, no, it's not. <laughs> what, did I say it wrong? Sorry, I did just I got a bit overexcited. Oh my Ooh. gosh, that's funny. So, where are we headed to, Kovacs? Right into the Cygnus lobby. Grand Hotel Cygnus? What for? There's a badge I need you to retrieve there. A badge? Oh, okay. Your holidays in Arcadia are about to begin. Access badge Soon overview. you'll be transported to the stunning city of tomorrow. But before you have dinner at the top of the Spire restaurant, enjoy the best disco music in the Limelight Club. Or discover the magic of Comet Land. There's something else you need to know. Introducing Access Badge, an amazing electronic device that will allow you to make the most of your Arcadia vacations. Carefully oh, wow. designed to look like a real 1970s prop, <laughs> your access badge will be scanned at the checkpoint terminal on your entry day, and that's it. You don't even need to check in at the front desk. Just use your access badge to get into your hotel room and start having fun. Wow. Even our auto droid operated room service will be entirely at your disposal thanks to your access badge. And remember, if you're using the Insta Delivery Service, your bags will be waiting in your room just a few well, seconds that's after cool. you open the door. Please carry your access badge with you at all times during your Arcadia visit until the day you leave at your assigned departure checkpoint. Now you are ready to experience the city of tomorrow as Elijah Walton himself envisioned it. Remember, enjoy your stay in Arcadia and... Do not break the fourth wall. Oh, wow. Do not break the fourth wall. Wow. Grand Hotel Cygnus Station. Please watch your step when exiting the car. Wow. Well, everybody, I think we're going to drop it off here. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please do. I'd really appreciate it. And see you guys next time. Bye.